Hey everyone, this is my walkthrough on Sly Cooper and the Thievus Raccoonus. We are in episode 3, Vicious Voodoo. And... Voodoo, huh? Voodoo, sorry. And anyways, guess what? We have all seven treasure keys, so we're gonna go off to the boss. And that was really weird how that pot lifted up. Anyways, here is the boss of Deadly Dance. Do the dance! Graphical limitations say that her tail has been severed off. And plus, she speaks way too damn slow. Text, move faster, we don't have a lot of time. Okay, that was weird. Well, fuck you. And anyways, this is a deadly dance. This is the boss of this level. And this entire fight is fought with rhythm. It's a rhythmic battle. So if you have bad rhythm, then don't even... Then this boss is going to be really hard for you. Alright, here we go. We can give you some damage. She takes too long to talk. I'm annoying. See, I can pay attention just fine. It's just that my PlayStation 2 buttons do not like to work with me on here. I think there actually is really something wrong with this controller. Watch me lose both of my horseshoes here. I won't be surprised if I die on this boss. Alright, so basically it's a rhythmic fight. She's basically gonna throw these... Sony PlayStation 2 buttons at you, and you have to press those buttons to dodge. I'd say on hardness, um, I'd say she's a pretty modest, let's say 7 or 8. Because, I mean, even though, like, I consider her boss fight, it looks really, really fun. It's actually really, really hard, I must say, for me. Because there are certain times where, for some reason, the button will not press. And while I'm coming here, I'm telling you, watch. I'll prove it right See, I pressed it at a perfect time, but apparently it said I didn't. Which is bullshit. Alright, so I lost one of my horseshoes. I really wish that they gave me more than two. I think three would have been a good one. Three would have been a good one. That would be good. Fucking dancing chickens. I never got that. Uh. Come on, die, you fat bitch. I just. Alright. Luckily, we'll have to go through this three times, so... I've been able to make through this without getting hit. I've beaten every single boss without getting hit before, so... Yeah. Alright, there we go. Let's see, on hardness, I'm gonna say that she's about to sit, um... On, no, on the prick -a meter I mean, sorry. Hmm. She's less of a dick than Mugshot. I don't know, she's kind of cool, I must say. I, like, she's cool, I like crocodiles or... Okay, you know what? This for that, she's a four. Right there. She's a four. I'm doing the rest of this without any protection whatsoever. Which is kind of bad, because for some reason, whenever she tries to attack us up close, she likes to expose her ass. There's going to be no what-what in the butt in this video, okay? I'm sorry.
This is just gonna keep speeding up right here. Ah, yes, I was able to do that. All right, she's dead. That was easy as hell. And once again, she's exposing her buttocks to us. I just noticed this. She's in like, like the way she's late. It's just weird. Apparently, she wants to do it like doggy style, well, technically the raccoon slash creepy fat crocodile style. Yeah, we're gonna be okay. Miss section of the Thebius Raccoonus held notes from my pioneering ancestor, slight and common. Ah. His invisibility technique allowed him to steal from corrupt pharaohs and greedy noblemen. Right on schedule, Inspector Fox's arrival cued my exit. The production of zombies made illegal in the World Peace Accord of 71. This <laughs> Ruby a life sentence behind bars. Hard check. While the Wait, gang and I it? enjoyed a few weeks in the tropical sunshine. Yay! In preparation for our next caper. Miss Ruby put up a fight, but Sly won. But there are still foes that stand in his way. Will half of the book, with half of the book completed, will Sly succeed, or will he fail? Skulk says these questions will be answered next time on Sly Cooper, the Furry Thief. Oh my God! 